In Europe today, every second counts. It's hard to believe how in such a short space of time so much has happened. A pandemic, war, an unprecedented energy crisis, not to mention the growing impacts of climate change. All of this has given even greater urgency now to the energy transition. And it's shown us that renewables are not just about climate change, they give us energy security and sovereignty. It's renewables that are going to bring down our energy bills. People now see we need more renewables ASAP. Which means we've got to sort out now the things that are holding us back from building all these new wind farms that governments now want. So it's time to simplify the permitting. EU's got good new rules now on permitting, overriding public interest, all the permits decided in two years, even sooner for repowering. Governments have now got to implement this and digitalize their permitting processes. It's time to ramp up our supply chain, to get it back to growth. Our industrial capacity and infrastructure has got to match government's new targets. It's time to make investments happen, to have stable rules in electricity markets, clear visibility on future auctions with big volumes and the right design. We've got to make Europe an attractive place again to invest in renewables. It's time to focus on the grid. There's no point building new wind farms if they're not connected to consumers. And it's time to electrify our transport, heating and industrial processes. Now all of this is going to require huge effort, of course, and collaboration between industry, government, NGOs, grid operators, energy consumers and communities. It's all hands on deck. It's time to deliver.